Hello, scientists. I'm going to show you how to log into the coding software today so you guys can get started. Um, coding is going to be a new Friday thing. Um, I'll talk about at the end uh, what's, um, uh, what the, what the routine is going to be, where I'm hopefully going to use Zoom and YouTube to help us uh, do it. But now that everyone has laptops, we can all code. Um, so this will be a big part of your grade moving forward. All right. So the first thing you're going to do is uh, read this because uh, a lot of you are not reading these things, and that is uh, resulting in a lot of confusion. Um, I'm doing this video to help you, but uh, in high school and, and beyond uh, in society, if someone writes directions, it's a good idea to read them. So I'm going to read those. For today's assignment, you need to complete at least five levels of Code Combat. Code Combat is an awesome game that teaches you coding language. To join the class and begin, you need to click the link below. That's this one. Click on I am a student. Enter the class code, deep game, deep, silly. It's also right up here. <clears throat> if you click on this, game, deep, silly. It then wants you to set up using your St. James email account, and then you start coding. So again, click on the link. Again, click on I am a student. These sixth graders should already be part of the class. If you are sixth grade, you can just click on this button, log in. Okay, do not click on sign up because it will think that you're trying to sign up again with the same email and it will not work. So click on I am a student. The secret phrase is hippopotamus. The secret phrase is hippopotamus. That is for the quiz that you'll be taking after this video. Um, the phrase for our student account is game deep. Now, when you get to this screen, you can, um, I suggest entering in, uh, creating an account with your uh, sign in with Google. So I'm going to click on this. And then um, if I were Mason, I would log in like this. So you would enter mason.austin at stjamesfila.org. Password. Wait for it to load. Okay, it says it's already in use, so I'm going to log in. Again, sign in with Google. You just got to be patient with it. Do not ever try to type in things like here. Always sign in with Google. It's easier. So again, I'm going to see this is one of those annoying things that you might quit, but you just got to do it over again. I'm not sure why it wants you to do this. But now Mason or any student is in. So you might have to try it twice, okay? So here, um, Mason has uh, gotten into an account, but he doesn't have um, his, uh, he doesn't have a class yet. So he, here's where he needs to enter game deep silly. So you see how you, you entered in those steps a couple of times? That's just the, the software kind of doing its thing. All right, now he's in the class, okay? And when he gets into the class, he can get started. And now he is in the game. So each one of these is a different level. So he clicks on this, play. And the way this works, the way that it teaches you how to code is um, you start the level and to move your character and to get your character to do things, you have to um, learn these coding, these coding uh, methods, okay? So these will get harder and more complex as you move along, but as you see, if I see it, hero dot move right, the hero moves right. If I want the hero to move down, I do hero dot move down, okay? Then the hero will move down. And then I wanna go right, and I'm not going to spoil it for Mason, so I'm going to get out of his um, his account. All right. So uh, that is how you do code combat. Um, make sure that you are signed in, logging in, and getting up to level five done. Level five. But again, there's going to be a quiz after this, so make sure you take that as well. Thanks.